In this video we share Pope Francis invites the Church to pray the Rosary to the Queen of Peace. The Pope will, together with shrines around the world, lead the Rosary Prayer for Peace in the Basilica of St. Mary the Great, May 31st, for those suffering from the war in Ukraine and wars around the world. The Prayer of the Rosary, which will conclude the Marian month, will be followed by a live broadcast via the official channels of the Holy See. Pope Francis will lead the Rosary for Peace as a sign of hope for those suffering from the war in Ukraine, as well as from wars around the world. It was announced today, on the Feast of the Ascension of the Lord, in a statement of the Pontifical Council for Promoting the New Evangelization, reports Vatican News. At the end of the Marian month, Pope Francis wants to offer a sign of hope to the world, which is suffering from the conflict in Ukraine and deeply wounded by the violence of many wars that are still ongoing, the statement said. Therefore, on Tuesday, May 31st, at 6 p.m., the Pope will pray the Rosary in front of the statue of Mary, Regina Passis, Queen of Peace, in the Roman Basilica of St. Mary Major. All the faithful, in every part of the world, are called to support Pope Francis in his prayer to the Queen of Peace, the statement said. The statue of Mary, Regina Passis, was commissioned by Pope Benedict XV to ask the Virgin Mary to end World War I in 1918. The statue, was made by Guido Galli, the then Deputy Director of the Vatican Museums. The Virgin is depicted with her left hand raised as a sign of the command to end the war, while the right holds the child Jesus, ready to throw an olive branch symbolizing peace. At the base are carved flowers that symbolize the flowering of life with the return of peace. It is traditional for believers to place small handwritten messages with prayer intentions at the feet of the Mother of God. The Pope will lay a wreath of flowers at the base of the statue, before addressing his prayer to Our Lady and leaving his special intention. Numerous groups will join the Pope in prayer in the Basilica. These will include first communicants, scouts, families from the Ukrainian community in Rome, representatives of the burning Marian youth, members of the Vatican Gendarmerie and the Pontifical Swiss Guard, as well as members of three Roman parishes dedicated to the Virgin Mary, Queen of Peace and members of the Roman Curia. As a sign of closeness, dozens will pray to the Ukrainian family, people associated with the victims of the war, as well as a group of military chaplains with their units. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.